6A, and this is the FY 2025 Juvenile <coughs> Justice and Senate Grant. Mr. Ty. Good evening. As we discussed yesterday morning, this is a continuation of the grant that we've uh, been awarded since 2014. They've uh, approved this um, grant will allow us to continue providing the FFT services through the juvenile court. Um, this is funding to um, serve 60 youth uh, here in the FY 25 um, cycle. And so I'm just asking for your authorization for the chair to sign um, the grant documents which will be included with the MOU to continue using evidence-based associates as our program manager. Uh, we'll be glad to answer any questions you might have about that. Any questions for Mr. Ty? Just one um, quick question as it pertains to uh, families. Uh, what percent uh, is, do you believe that it may be uh, single parent families versus uh, families with both parents? I, I would, the, the most comfortable I would say, be willing to say is that I would think the majority, um, and that could be, when I say majority, that's more than 50% are probably single parent households. Um, but I, I don't really, I haven't asked and haven't been tracking statistics. We um, could get that information. I, I can get it for you afterwards. Uh, you know, I can get you whatever statistics you need, but um, that's not something that we've really been tracking as far as single parent versus multi-family households. That's why, if I've looked at the demographics over, over time and it never really says single parent versus two yeah. parent, so thanks. And the reason they don't track that, I mean, it doesn't really change the, the, the services. You know, I guess most, a lot of studies show that, you know, those who have both parents in their household tend to you know, have better outcomes. But. Well, I, I think that's kind of a given yeah. from a social standpoint that we, that we come to realize is that <clears throat> single parents have not only the challenges of being a single parent, certainly in the rearing of children makes it even more difficult and challenging. I think that's one of the things that makes this program so important is it does provide an extra tool for those families that are single parent households that it just gives them a little, little extra to, to help. If you could ask that question of the juvenile court, they would give us some sort of idea for Mr. Marshall. Any other questions? Okay. Hearing none, I'll entertain a motion. Chairman, sure, I move we authorize you to sign the application document. Okay, we have a lengthy motion from Mr. Ornstein. <laughs> we'll have a second. We'll have a second. Any discussion? That turns that. That's right. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call the vote. All in favor, signify by aye. Aye. Any opposed, like sign. Hearing none, motion carries. Agenda item.